Hey guys, I am Pixel Dan, and today we're gonna take a look at this new Nickelodeon slime that blows slime bubbles. That is right, my friends, it's the Slime Bubble Blower. This is a new toy from the folks at NSI International. So this is the current company that's putting out the Nickelodeon Slime toys, as well as the Nickelodeon Gak toys. Uh, you can see some of the other stuff they have right here on the back, like they got Gak in the dark, they've got the Gak fur buckets, which I did take a look at in a separate video, but they've also got some nice traditional Nickelodeon slime. And of course, slime has been a big part of Nickelodeon on the net, Work. Uh, they kind of brought slime mainstream in the 90s and it's pretty cool that they've actually got slime toys out there now like in the 90s they had Gak but I don't remember them having traditional slime like this and I know in in recent years they have put out a lot of slime stuff because the slime craze is huge right now slime toys are back in force in the toy aisles and I think that's awesome because I'm a big fan of them so let's go ahead and rip this open and check out the slime and the blowing bubble feature all right, so we got our slime bubble blower opened up. So inside of the little bubble blower pipe here, uh, we've just got a little plastic baggie of bright green slime. And it's not a resealable bag or anything like that. I assume that this will also just work as the container for your slime to store it. You can see you do have a lid that kind of opens and closes on the top. I'm a little worried though, because you do have this little hole in the bottom because this is where you're supposed to blow to make the bubbles. So is the slime just gonna ooze out of this? when we store it in here so I guess we're gonna have to look at the storage techniques with this uh, to see if that's something that's even possible but let's go ahead and open up this little bag here uh, we can really check out the slime inside see what the consistency is like with this stuff all right there we go got the bag ripped open and kind of pour this stuff out Urgh, come on let's get him out of this bag it actually feels really nice it's got a bit of a stickiness to it oh look at that look at the way it's like sticking to my fingers there that's a really really nice slime okay Let's get the rest of it out of the bag here. All right, so here is our Nickelodeon slime. It's definitely a lot different than the Gak. So that's right, that's exactly how it should be. Like Gak is much more clumpy, it's not as runny. Look at this stuff. This stuff is actually oozing really, really well. And you can see it's got a really good stickiness to it too. So it kind of sticks to your fingers. Uh, I bet this stuff actually drips really good. Yeah, look at that. This is a really, really nice slime. And I always like checking different slime toys like this because, of course, those of us who grew up in the 80s and 90s, we're always looking for substitutes for slime, for some of our old slime toys like Masters of the Universe and Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. So it's always good to find proper good substitutes in stores right now. This stuff is working out really well. Look at this. Look how it stretches and kind of sticks and just kind of runs. This is a really, really good slime. I like the, and it coats your hand really well. Look at that. Really solid slime. So great work to NSI here for putting out some awesome, awesome Nickelodeon slime. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and test this little container here. So if we open the lid on the top, should be able to squeeze this stuff down inside here. So I'm worried because you, you probably want to use this to store your slime too because you got to keep slime closed up. That way it doesn't dry out. Obviously you don't want it running all over the place. Um, I'm worried about this little hole in the bottom here. Is it going to run through that? Maybe there's actually like a barrier there. But I don't know. I don't know if it's going to come out. Actually it seems pretty good. I don't have any issues right now with it running out. But it's definitely something I think we're going to need to watch out for. Actually let me see if I can press it down. No, maybe not. Let's pull the slime out. Because it looks like the tube just goes straight down and around. I don't know, maybe this is built well so we don't have to worry about that stuff actually falling through. Here, let's go ahead and run the slime back in here again. So, it looks like you probably can store it in here. I would definitely keep an eye on that though. Because I don't know if that's going to at least mean air gets in there and helps to dry it out. But this does look really cool when it's in this little container, right? Almost looks like a sewer pipe or something with a slime in it. Definitely actually has a very 90s Nickelodeon vibe. I think that's really cool. But this right here is supposed to be our bubble blower. And I know that we all want to see how this works. So I guess it's time for me to test this out. Let's blow some slime bubbles. Okay, here we go. Are we ready? We're going to try to blow some slime bubbles with our slime bubble blower. I don't know if there's a trick to this, so I'm 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 just I'm just going to try it. <laughs> a 
I'm not really getting any good bubbles yet. It's just kind of like bubbling it up up there. Here we go. Let's try again. Oh, I almost had it that time. Maybe I need to get all the air squeezed out of the bottom here because we got to get the air to get like inside the slime. Okay, here we go. Shake all the air out. Oh, I was so close that time. Did you see it? Oh, man. Okay, we got to get this. We got to get this. I almost wonder if you're like... I almost wonder if you need more slime to make this work right. Or you just gotta get all the air out of the bottom here. Cause you need the air to get captured underneath the slime to blow the bubble. And it's just kind of like blowing out on the side, which is what's causing it to like just flub around like that. Okay. <laughs> I feel like I'm blowing into my slime inhaler. <laughs> Come on. We gotta do at least one good slime bubble. So it is possible. Oh wow, and now it's all stuck to me. <laughs> that, well that creates a bit of a mess, but holy cow. So it takes a little bit of work. You gotta really get it in there good so that the air captures underneath it. It's gonna be messy, but you know what? This thing's a lot of fun. And the slime inside is really good slime. So if you're looking for a fun slime toy, I would recommend this one. I think this one's pretty cool. I found this one at Target, so it's in stores right now. So happy hunting, my friends. Let's try this again. Dang it, I was so close. 